I'd like to tell you a story about an incident that occurred a few decades ago. I was uh, at a friend's house. He goes by the name of Sutsu Mahai. Now, Sutsu, I don't know if you're still in this existence. If you are, I don't know if you and your family are well. It's been a long time. If you're in eternity, then I'll catch up with you in due course. And I was around at Sutsu's place, and I wasn't a singer at the time, because they're playing bass and guitar. And uh, I remember Sutsu turning to one of his children, who was a child was misbehaving slightly, no big thing. But he reprimanded him just briefly. And as he did so, from his voice, the whole room shook. I remember feeling it. I wasn't a singer, so I wasn't as interested as I am now, uh, at the time. But uh, I remember it, I remember being struck by it to this day. So I'm going to give you a scenario. Get away from my life! I'm going to explain to you what that feels like. This opens in a split second, this which you can't see. The lower belly releases, draws air in. Every muscle around here contracts. This opens and now it comes. What else am I to do? It's the first line of attack. I haven't got my spear with me. There are no stones I can see by the time I bend down and look through. He's eaten my wife. What am I to do? It's the first thing, isn't it? Natural. Mighty intelligence takes care of it. Don't have to think. Thinking would be no good. You'd be eaten before I figured out what to do. Also, it leaves me feeling like this. Because I've noticed this before, that it triggers fight or flight. Probably because that's the only time naturally you do something like that, is in a situation like that. So that's one thing. Huge amount of air. A lot of effort, a lot of uh, muscular power just takes care of itself. Can we use it? Well, you could use it like that, I suppose. I'm wondering what, if I want to take it a bit higher. So maybe I use some of that there, and maybe I want to take it a bit higher. I have to put some more air into it, more effort. Starts to get a bit stressful. Higher we get, if you're going to keep the pipe open, good luck to you. Could do this. Get away from my life! Now, I don't know if you can tell, I've left the sound flat. That doesn't shake the walls. And what I've noticed is that sometimes people use that. I've heard them in the street shouting at their children and they kind of, get in there! Get in! They use that kind of distortion. But I get the feeling the child knows as the, the beast, as the lion or the panther, would know some subtle intelligence, just knows that that's not true. It hasn't come from there. This is what Sutsu Mahai had. And that's what struck me, apart from the sheer physicality of the guy just turning and doing it, is there's a, an honesty to it, a directness that's just, the guy's not faking. You can just tell, just, just cause any sentient being to, to stop. Got some other things, can I take it higher? I'm gonna see if we can use it over music in a minute. Yes, let's see. Do 
doing a C. Roughly right about. Can I do it round there? Not so comfortable. Can I do it round there? Maybe. It's just to get that, it just requires more and more effort the higher it goes that it starts to become stressful. There are ways to change it, which we do naturally sometimes. E flat, don't want to damage myself there. It'll recover. Can I do it there? Can I do it there? Maybe. F, so I tone down from my top note. Not for long. What ways are there around it then? That I'm going to call fully open. I'm going to call that fight or flight. Flight or fight, whichever way you want to call it. I can narrow the instrument. With a narrow instrument, I don't need such a huge draft of air. So fairly low down, maybe. There we go. If I narrow it! If I narrow it! Yeah, that's kind of easier and then that distortion is associated. It hasn't got the same room-shaking ability. Take it a bit higher, maybe see? If I narrow it! If I narrow it! Mm -hmm. Up to an F. Forgive me. If I narrow it! If I narrow it! Loads of distortion in there but it's easier in some ways than being fully open. Now, bear something in mind. This is something I've noticed. This is such a physical thing, and it is in a sense, in a sense aggressive, that really you need to have an emotional capability to go with it. So this is something I've noticed with young men, is that they're going for this sound that they hear, and they go, all of it's like that, and all of it's there, it's like that. Because there's not the behind it. You've got to be prepared to do something which is going to feel rather threatening to anybody who's near you. That's what I noticed with Sutsu, uh, Mihai. It was, he wasn't threatening, he was a decent guy. Decent guy, he just wanted his students to stop doing what they were doing. And he just got, we were in the middle of rehearsal, and he just put his voice above the band. He didn't raise his voice, that's something else I want to watch out for. We use that expression, raise your voice, and maybe subconsciously we think of, raise the bitch, and we all go up there and it all gets on the throat. Where he's, he just, it was volume, it just got bigger. It didn't raise it, it didn't go up in any pitch. That was, that was partly what was, um, what was so um, impactful about it. That he didn't raise it in that sense, in terms of pitch. Nonetheless, it's quite disturbing if you're around it. I know uh, I had a, a next girlfriend of mine and she just starts crying. I don't if I, anything of that volume, was, she just, <laughs> just starts crying. Well, maybe that's just her. I don't know, but it had that effect on her. Not, I didn't do it. I was demonstrating as I'm demonstrating now, have you know, I'm not shouting at her. So it seems to me then that you need that emotional ability to be able to do that with people around you and do it honestly. And, but you are aware that it, some people may find it quite disturbing. So you've got to have that weight to be able to do that. Weight of emotional security, whatever it is. To do that. Younger guys don't think they've got that and it all goes on the throat there. So watch out for that because it does disturb oneself as well. I talked about the fight or flight. You will find yourself in a, in a sort of, in a, in a ready for something really from it. And it can become a little bit of a drug actually as well. Bit of a high, get used to it. So, distortion is what I was using there when it narrowed. Can I do distortion down? I can't really do it low. I want to put distortion down there. I can really, but it, I don't want to do too much. I'm very comfortable. It comes into its own about halfway up into what I call the power band. And I often think about those uh, soul brothers and them. Church, and I, which probably all, I'm guessing it all came from church, where probably uh, you needed to get your voice over. Uh, you didn't have microphones and so on back in the, in the gospel in the early days, and you probably got used to the power band. It's the only place you could get heard. Maybe blues shouters as well. It's the only place you get heard. So you listen to, to James Brown and people like that. You get on. Yeah, 
So, I'm thinking that's where, if you were doing that uh, in gigs all the time, it's just a power band. You've got to have about half octave where you can do that. James Brown seems to me is one of the, a good example of that was, rest in peace, is that you're in that power band there. I'll tell you something else I noticed, another little story. When I was at church, it's an English church. <laughs> Not high church. English church was people from all over. So there was a black American pastor, actually, Freddie Robertson. Yes, sir. But a lot of English people, no, no, I'm not saying, but I, I don't know, some of you, it's quite. So, no, one of the guys was there, a preacher. I did, I did, I did, I did, I did, he used to stutter. He could get up on stage and start to, to preach. And it, it just, so, and I, I'd, be, I'd be listening to him, I did, I did, I did, and so slowly, Slowly he'd start to, uh, slowly he'd start, he'd start moving and you'd see, and his hand would start, slowly his hand would start to, uh, I don't know what you're doing, I'll be there, he'll be telling you all about it, and I'll be telling you how he feels, and how, he was hallelujah, hallelujah, we'll be going on and he'd be shaking it, and all of a sudden, no stuttering, again, I wasn't a singer really, though. I was playing piano in the church and I was, Watching all this going on, and thinking, what's going on there? And, uh, yeah. Just suddenly, there it was. Hand shaking. <sighs> it's a bit like vomiting. Both of you are looking for this. Uh, I don't recommend vomiting, but I haven't. It's been, I've been lucky, perhaps. It's been a long uh, time. But if you know what that's like, the body takes care of it. You can sense it's coming from what I remember same sort of thing happens and there's no way this is going to stop it no way this is going to stop it it doesn't fight itself <laughs> same way with this it doesn't fight itself if you have doubts about it or worries and you start to fight i think that's where the damage comes because you've got powerful powerful muscles doing this and then you've got some other part of you think oh no, 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 i'm not i'm not that oh, no, no, scaring people oh, no, I'm not that. so you get the fighting it has to be as i say like vomiting Sorry. Fake. Fake. Fake is fashionable these days, is it not? I, I hear from various people, fake this and fake that. So what you do get then, and this saves, if you're not strong enough and you it saves it, is you can fake it. So let me just go through the various things over here. Oh, oh. I'm going to keep something fairly low down. If I wanna do something down there, wanna do something, keep it quiet, go if I wanna do something down there, wanna do something, keep it, take it a bit higher, take it a bit higher, take it a bit higher, keep it high, try and keep the distortion out, try to keep the distortion out, gotta keep breathing cause it uses so much air, go up there, keeping the distortion out, go up there, keeping the distortion out, go up there, keeping the distortion out, 
distortion now. Turn up the low it's distortion. Turn up the distortion now. Don't break up so I'm gonna go to the mid band if I'm gonna put distortion in. Maybe I'm gonna be there. Ha. Gonna be there with distortion in. Found I'm gonna be there. Gonna be there with I'm going up there with some distortion in our better. So I can, if I'm gonna fake it, I'm gonna leave the lower thing out of it because I can't really fake it down there. But I couldn't do this up there. I could. I could be the doing the stuff up there. Kind of faking it, you can hear it's nowhere near as loud. 